In this video, we will focus on area of triangle. So let's say we have a triangle. First, you need to know that the information needed is two side and an included angle so in order to find the area of triangle we need the information of two sides which is the length and an included angle which is the angle in between so let's say if i use this side let's say i just concentrate on this side so this is the formula so the area of triangle abc will be 1 over 2 bc two side and an included angle sine a so we need two side and an included angle so 1 over 2 bc sine a so bc sine a so two side this is the side side b and side c and the included angle let's look at example let's say example one figure below show a triangle of pqr so this is pqr with the side of PQ is 7 cm and PR is 12 cm. And the angle is 42 degree, the angle of P. Find the area of the triangle PQR. So since we have the information, which is two side and an included angle. Included angle. So straightforward, we can use a formula. Let's say area of triangle PQR is equal to 1 over 2. Let's say AB sine C. So which is 1 over 2, 2 side. So the side is 7 and 12 times 7 times 12 sine c so where c is the angle which is 42 degree so by using our calculator 1 over 2 times 7 times 12 times sine 42 degree so the answer will be 28.103 103 cm square so this is the area now we move on to example two figure below show a triangle of abc again this is the triangle abc with ab is 15 cm ac is 18 cm and the angle of b is 80.5 degree so the question is find the area of abc so again if we want to find the area of triangle so the information is we need is either we need this length let's say length of this or we need this angle so let's say i try to find the angle of a and then i can use the formula of triangle so i just concentrate on this side for example so next what i have to do is i need to find this angle based on the information that we have first what i can do is so let's say i just concentrate on this part First, what I can do is I try to find this angle by using cosine rule. After that, I use 180 degree minus 80.5 and this angle. So first, let's say here is the angle sine C over the opposite side is 15 cm will be equals to sine 80.5. And the opposite angle is 18. From here, I should get the angle of C. So sine C will be equals to sine 80.5 over 18 multiplied by 15. So sine C will be equals to, let's say, sine 80.5. 
divide by 18, multiply by 15. So it's 0 0.8219. So C will be equal to sine inverse 0 0.8219. So shift sine and then in the bracket 0 0.8219. So the angle, suppose, is 55.28. So remember, this is not the angle that we're going to use. I need the angle of A. So angle of A will be equal to 180 degree minus 80.5 minus 55.28. So from here again, 180 minus 80.5 minus 55.28. So the angle is 44 point. So here is 44 point 22 degree. So this is the angle of A. So now we already have the angle of A, 44.22. Then we can find the area. So area, therefore, area of triangle ABC is equals to 1 over 2. Generally, is 1 over 2 AB sine C. So which is equals to 1 over 2. AB is the side, which is 15 times 18 sine the angle between the side is 44.22 so the answer will be 1 over 2 multiplied by 15 multiplied by 18 multiplied by sine 44.22 so from here we should have 94.15 1 cm Square. So this is the area of the triangle.